Alright people, how are you guys doing? You good? You're good. I'm good. We're all good. Um, welcome back to a little bit of IXION gameplay. Ixion, Tycoon, and all that shit. Uh, we are in chapter 4. Are we? Let's check. Yes, officially chapter 4. Um, the situation is we have the Piranesi powered down over here okay An accident has occurred in the tycoon and we have a bunch of checklists i'm gonna do some i'm gonna just chill out you know do some regrouping before i i um do the main mission we're gonna find some stuff here there's no iron here so we're gonna have to oh there's iron there's a bit of iron right um we have one mining ship and we have four cargo ship so okay and i have a science ship should i have another science ship let's see on deck build one we do have some polymer and how's the solar situation let's see oh we maxed out on the solar so it has to be nuclear power next right okay let's see so this is the sector one it has now become a port as you can see <laughs> we maxed out on um resources certain resources let's see yeah we need to move some sector one is full in terms of housing we need to move about 60 people um yeah they can go to sector four i guess um a lot of space there space sector two as well we need to find like right now the, the main resource that we need to find is um bodies we need bodies we need people right so yeah And otherwise, we're okay in terms of resources. Okay. So let's research some stuff that will make more waste. Because that has to be the future, right? Oh, there's a bunch of things that I haven't researched yet. Hull Temple. Um, observ observatory. How do you pronounce this word? Observatory. I researched this exo fighting drone dome even had like people saying I should build it but it's too big it's large you know so forget that for now um DLS center policy cooldown stability penalty from only awakening workers is changed to a negative one a, a gauge let's see the propaganda grants Ooh, i might need that one so we're gonna research this and that next what else can we research comrades of era yeah let's just ah uh, i did that again i uh, know dls center first and then this one yeah let's do some research for quality of life stability and we need to start mining um okay so i've even turned off a few farms here because we just don't have workers mm, maybe i should turn this on oh man yeah as you can see sector overwork sector overwork Sector 4 and Sector 3. Let's just send some people there. 4 and 3. Um, let's see if there's things that we can turn off. No. Nah, everything's burning. 
things that we can turn off polymer yeah let's turn that off for a bit for a while we need to be making um at this point maybe food like i like my food to be at 200 percent so should i turn this on Population yeah turn this on um the hospital we're gonna turn this off that uses a lot of workers we don't need them all the time when there's injury oh man why is this farm burning let's see the food situation 170 percent okay let's assess the situation we have a shitload of workers on six and we need workers on one three and four so let's send some workers like i could probably spare 20 30 workers maybe so one three and four need workers um let's see population transfer complete it's looking for things that i can turn off colonists we're not training colonists today not yet um this is fine it's fine let me switch the view <laughs> i'm more used to this part um uh it's fine that's fine that is fine what else can we turn off let's go back to four we have a lot of electronics i think yeah we need to repair the hull so i'm turning off on both the steel mills and should i yeah food is okay so we're gonna leave farms as it is as is farms don't use workers but they do use water and i have this a water treatment center i'm wondering if it's enough to just use this and we don't need a fusion station but i'm not sure so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna gamble okay <laughs> um we could build one more field i think let's do that um we build one more field i wonder if you guys are watching if you play which one do you prefer algae farm or the uh, crop farm or are you too homophobic to <laughs> use an algae farm whatever that means and anything else we can switch off looks okay for now let's do the let's see see through the worker transfers see if it helps right and meanwhile we send out some probes An accident has occurred in the tycoon we should send science here oh we have an, an, has arrived at its destination. an extra science ship right so probably gonna do that send an extra an extra wait what's the extra science ship we've got tesla that's the one population transfer complete oh we're still building that one send out some probes so we can start mining for stuff and maybe points of interest as well let's see what's uh let's save the game <laughs> chapter four is this the last chapter i'm not sure it should be um chapter five being the ending right okay we are collecting signs but that's fine okay um planetary readings from 12th age fall outside the parameters of theoretical models whatever that means intense okay we landed on this planet intense geological activity fissures um expel gas into the atmosphere and canyons run deep across the planet's surface we have located a stable area where we should be able to study this planet, I guess. So I'm going to do the... Mm, should I? 
Um, yeah, but we need. Um, okay. One moment. Let me start making more alloys, right? Using these waste treatment centers. And then we can send infrastructure advanced analysis. I prefer the safe option most of the time. And let's, yeah, send this guy. Meanwhile, let's check cargo situation. Yeah, we're sending iron. Okay. Let's speed the game up. And why is this a food problem? Um, oh, not enough food to... And I'm going to be honest, I have no idea how to distribute food. <laughs> Right now, I'm setting uh, 0 for 3 and 6 and 120 for Sector 4 because Sector 4 is like the furthest from Sector 6. I haven't opened up Sector 5, so yeah. So right now, we need bodies, so we're going to research. Um, let's see if we can send some workers to Sector 1 here, right? Seems like sector one needs workers. Population transfer complete. Okay. So we need bodies. So right now we should be sending our science team everywhere. Trying to look for cryopods. And this one is still going on. And keep on probing. Keep on probing. We need those bodies, right? We need workers and once we have a lot of workers, a surplus of workers, we could probably open up a new sector, a science ship which is what I'm looking for. Before we do the exploration stuff, let's see what else we can research. Um, cryonic center. Wait, what was we were TLS center? Yeah, additional plus one stability. Yep, let's do that. And I maxed out on the steel mill stuff. I maxed out. No, not yet. Waste treatment center, recycling electronics 20% faster. Let's do that and let's do this. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Let's go to this planet and make sure we make a safe choice. And I'm going to be a bit more anxious. This is chapter four and I'm going to do a lot of saving. I hope the save games don't take up too much of my hard drive space. Um, let's see. Ooh. So what I've noticed is all the choices now have more um, resource using choices okay our probe detected abnormal me meteorological activity on PSRB 125712 G <laughs> the names bro um, calling into question our theoretical models abnormal so abnormal stuff happening I guess Ionized hydrogen, purple shaded tornadoes, immense green cumulonimbus clouds, tornadoes surrounding and circle a massive cyclone on the planet, tongue twisters, right? Large enough in size to be observ observable from space. Poetry. <laughs> so we're going to launch an autonomous analysis drone. Seems like the safest bet. And let's send one of our guys here. Okay. So it's going to be a lot of exploration in the beginning. And we need iron, so let's do that. So let's see. So you can see our cargo ship. Uh, 
going back and it's gonna it's gonna retrieve some stuff what's this guy doing? oh this guy transfer complete yep I wish we could see like notification of our base somewhere here so I can be on this screen and also monitor sort of like the the sectors but I should be okay should be okay as long as stability is fine because I want to monitor this part of the game right now. Well, what's going on here? Technology has been unlocked. Okay, let's see what else we can research. Because we only have one more um, mission research to unlock. Water treatment center we've unlocked. Um, oh, by the way, I did construct a drone bay, bay. You know what it does? It really adds up. It really minim... Uh, uh, it slows the game down. The game lags. I don't have the beefiest PC. I use a gaming laptop to game. And it slows up the whole thing, the system. Um, the FPS was struggling with the drones. It's flying. It looks cool. And it transports like uh, stuff faster. But it just slows the game down. Yeah. <clears throat> So four cycles before we're done. An accident has occurred in the tycoon. So we're going to keep probing. Just keep probing. But of course, ideally, we're going to be self-sufficient, right? And everything looks cool. Oh, uh, the mass hall getting. Yeah. Are we making um, alloy? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. We're going to replace a lot of this stuff with... Uh, let me see. Yeah. With like recycling stuff, right? Maybe I should, I should do research on waste. Let's see. Um, polymer refinery. Production speed. Um, so we can make more waste. The more waste we make, um, smart homes, capacity of housing, infirmary, 10 more beds. That's good for quality of life. Cell housing all unlocked. Algae farm. One additional plantation. Oh, so high pressure fusion station upgrade. Where's the fusion station? High pressure cutters, production speed is increased. Okay. Um, no, no. Is there anything to do with waste? Yeah, let me check it out. None yet, none that I can see yet. Oh, large stockpile. Uh, nothing to do with waste yet. Cryonic center. Produce more waste. Will this have no waste here? Hmm. I'm hoping we could produce more waste, so I'll have more waste. Waste is a commodity now, and you can see you were using up all the waste. Yeah, at the moment waste is um it doesn't pile up, meaning the moment waste is retrieved, is sent immediately to sector six. And I was thinking another farm uh, sector, but I think this would be enough. And just like, I think recycling should be the priority right now, right? Yeah. Okay. How's the mission going? Uh, slow. Four cycles. Technology unlock. A building is on fire. Once we got those bodies, has completed its we can. Oh, there's some. Yeah, some stuff to pick up. Um. Probe has completed its scan. Keep scanning. Oh, we don't want to scan over there. 
because there's a storm or something. You can see this looks like a port with like all these uh, stockpiles, right? <laughs> it's looking more like a port. But it can't be, it just doesn't turn into like a tier 2 or tier 1, tier 2 sort of like space. Uh, uh, how do I say it? Let's see. Yeah, it doesn't have a specialization because all my EVA airlocks are in sector 4. But this is where we're making all the... The, uh, whatchamacallit? The alloys. That's where I'm making all the alloys. So it's, it's easier to have all the EVA airlocks here. And the alloy just straight up transfer to here, right? So sector 1... In the oh man, what's with, oh, with all the fire? Um, I should probably be making more docking base. That should be the next project. Docking base. Where can I fit? I can't even fit docking base anymore. I need to just reorganize some stuff. I could probably build more down here. Move these buildings somewhere else. Right. Ooh, we are eating up the alloys because of the hull integrity. Yeah, so I'm just waiting for more more bodies. Right now I'm waiting for more bodies. Let's see the sector. It looks good, doesn't it? The layout looks like... <laughs> Man, imagine if you could do first person walking in this game. Yeah, look at all this gigan gigantic recycling buildings. 50 workers for the health center, by the way. So any injuries, I'm going to turn that on. Even though I have no... So trust, look at trust, 7.8%. Point, point that's, that's good. Let's see what else we can research. It's going to, taking some time to do the missions. Pulse deterioration while moving. Okay, let's do that. Um, stockpiles, no, not yet. Mining ship. Um, cargo ship. Docking bay upgrade. Okay, I haven't upgraded a docking bay that much. Loading and unloading is faster. Construction speed. Yeah, let's do some research on that. Right, let's spend all these research points. See the progress of oh, taking a while. It's taking a while. Um, because you know why? Because um, because they have to. Uh, so basically, this is where the ship is chilling, and it's waiting for resources. And what sector is this? Sector one. Yeah, we're hogging the resources in sector f How much alloy do we need for EVA airlocks? Let's see. Um, about three per airlock per cycle. One, two, three, four. So to be safe, 15. So we can probably send over some alloy to sector one. And sector one. probably send some alloy to sector one there's 15 alloys but we are not making enough alloys um yeah it kind of looks like you know it kind of looks like we need another eva airlock but yeah i'm not sure or well, maybe I have to play this game out and see what happens, right? So this guy is just waiting for stuff. Oh, electronics. I need to turn this on. This stockpile. And this guy is waiting for polymer. He's got his stuff. This guy is waiting for electronics 
So we need electronics in sector one. So let's give them a sector one those electronics, right? So I'm not going to build anything new because we are short staffed and okay now we're sending those resources we are short staffed but we don't have the staff to sort of um if we have a new building we need staff <laughs> um and we don't have alloy either yeah bear in mind Let's look for iron. Oh, large deposit here. Let's fine tune that a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah, let's do the missions, get the science points. And maybe I should do some more research. Um, on the ships. Oh, EVA airlock has some research I can do. Construction speed. Um, repair, repair efficiency, um, construction. Let's do EVA airlock stuff because EVA airlock looks a bit. Um, what's the word here? They look a bit fragile, especially every time you move to a new system, the hull integrity reduces by a lot. So, yeah, keep that in mind. Right. Yeah. New technology, keep researching technologies, right? Yeah. Probe, uh, we're gonna lay off the probe. Repair efficiency, yes, let's do that. And let's unlock everything in this EVA airlock quality of life research, that's why I call them call it and okay we've got a mission here a science ship team has science ship team has completed its test save as, as much as we can okay so that if i mess up i don't have to go back too far okay the drone fabrication pattern kutiman took off from the cargo bay of the Tesla. So now we have the data to update theoretical models of this planet. I'm not going to pronounce the name. The team has concluded that the pulsar activity of the system has a significant impact on the atmosphere. The phenom phenomena observed unexplainable without external factors. If you guys understand it, good for you. I don't. <laughs> okay, while preparing to depart from 12G, they spotted something un unusual, different from the observed meteorological phenomena. A translucent tubular formation pierces the cloud cover and rises high into the atmosphere. Someone here has a very large package. <laughs> <laughs> tubular formation um this might this might um <laughs> this we might shoot ourselves in the foot trying to check out this thing um yeah we are discoverers so let's do that okay we have completed theoretical uh, model of 12h Freddy Vogt showed signs of mental distress, concerned that the gas expulsions were the cause. Suit integrity tests no breaches. So Freddy Vogt was seen leaving the research site. Just one guy. Um, are we gonna be heroes? Yeah, let's locate the guy. Okay, let's locate the guy. There's a lot of sciences. Um to be collected here so we're gonna keep on sciencing sciencing 
Okay, anything to do with... Let's do all the EVA airlock stuff. Construction speed. Um, and plasma cutter. Right? Let's, let's just complete the EVA airlock stuff. An accident has occurred in okay. Because hull integrity is... A you can see. Team has completed a task. Whoa. They might be giants? They might be... You know what? I'm, I'm going to take note of that. They might be giants. They might be... Uh, let, let me just... Give me a moment here. That, that's interesting right there. It's going to take a note on that. Oof. The first received images from the Tesla, a presence of a huge and translucent tubular, tubular formation. It possesses luminescent properties. The meteorological activity is calm and glimpses of the... I'm not going to read all that. The captured image, imagery disproves this hypothesis of crew hallucination and it seems like our team is interested to continue with further analysis. Um, yeah, we're interested, right? Yeah, with the tube. <laughs> it might just be a giant, you know what? And someone is sleeping. Okay, how about this one? Reports from the Heisenberg team have become inconsistent. This is like some The Thing, you know, the movie kind of, kind of stuff. Psychological instability. The team, oh no, the team is following the tracks of... <laughs> are we like going to do this? Like, are we like... It's some white people shit, right? See something weird? Let's check it out. I would just instinctively <laughs> get the F out but yeah we are explorers and we are exploring and let's keep probing for stuff let's keep probing and probing get as much iron as we can <clears throat> while exploring this system right This one is almost done. A ship team has completed okay, a let's do this research uh, before we get into that. More EVA. Let's finish. Construction speed is increased. Okay. So, uh, what else can we do? A science ship. A cargo ship. No more research. Design instruction upgrade. So we need to, let's see here, docking bay. Yeah, we need to upgrade the docking bay stuff. Design instruction, spaceship. Loading in and only, okay. Let's do some probing. And how's the ship situation? Well, this guy's mining whatever he can get his hands on. Right now we need iron. We have a, a bucket loads of carbon. Um, I think we got a good amount of ice, but we need to keep. Okay. Data collected is contradictory. Um, reading reading from the beacons fluctuate. Science science talk science talk science talk. So the tubing generates a weak electromagnetic field beta radius come on man don't don't <laughs> don't insult the guy like that beta radiation come on it's he's an alpha i mean have you seen something like that in your world and for tachyons whatever that means there's some theories and they, these these guys are curious like they're recommending a more invasive follow up follow up study <laughs> mission safety protocols advise um, that the team who are exhibiting a concerning form of fascination for the tubing should be repatriated I'm thinking we are discoverers right 
initiate invasive analysis of the tubing. We're going to check out the tubes. These guys are fascinated with tubes. Okay. Maybe we should collect some of these sciences before we move on. Okay. So we can do some research on our ships. Store more resources. We need that. What else can we do? Mining ship research stuff. And let's pick up these sciences because we're about to run out of science points. Administrator, a new request awaits your attention. Okay, new request. I realize this icon here that shows where the request is. Okay, crew members are spreading rumors about the DLS. They think they are under constant observation. And the information they receive have has been changed to encourage them to comply with Dolo's guidelines. We have some rebels. They are not wrong. <laughs> but their interpretation of the process is crude. They are not being monitored but recorded. So that if there was ever any doubt about an individual, it could be reviewed, information not altered but expressed the individual in a personalized manner to ensure their con I think this text is trying to proper uh, you know trying to give me some propaganda I feel like I'm being you know observed here to ensure their continued emotional stability okay you were not monitored you were recorded you are not being lied to we merely adapt our speech it is necessary to protect ourselves from deviant and okay so i gotta play the politician now it's interesting right here to protect ourselves from deviant and conspiratorial behavior okay the third option these data collection practices are managed by the pa of the tycoon as an administrator I am also under their supervision. These systems are crucial for the balance of the station. The third option looks interesting because number one, these guys might fear AI like most people and think that saying that the PA, but AI is mostly balanced, right? So, and when I say, you know, there's some self-deprecating stuff here, also under their supervision i might be relatable so let's see if this works out so i might take this option saying that i am too being supervised okay hopefully but what's the food situation here zero or starving really or starving it's, it's mostly like because not enough food stored right yeah production is at 200 <laughs> Alright, so we're collecting science, I think. Okay. Ah, oh. Com's contact with the Heisenberg team has been lost. The house is much bigger on the inside. I'm curious about this house. Interior light source. No interior light source. Series of mazes. Thumping sounds. I mean, lesson learned, right? <laughs> Thumping sounds. So, yeah. Rest in power to Praskov, Kovia, Ler, Lerzov, Freddy Vod, Lisandro Vidal, Alonso Eustachin, and Nori Kuta Kuwata. Abandon the Heisenberg. Wait. Just as the Heisenberg has been declared as lost, whoa, Freddy Vod contacted, it. we pronounce him dead. <laughs> They have returned uh, and are in possession of a strange, translucent and gelatinous sample. After rapid analysis, it is composed of unknown particles held together by fraud tachyon. Uh, Freddy Vogt appears to be extremely dis... Whoa, we pronounce them dead and suddenly there's a phone call. <laughs> it's a horror movie right now. Yeah, creepy settings. Freddy, uh, as the British would say, appears to be extremely requires medical assistance, psychological support. 
They are returning to the tycoon aboard the Heisenberg. Interesting. The story is starting to get interesting. Right, and collect the sciences. Um, Alright, let's see what else we can research. Right? Or should we... Um, no, 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 let's not save on research points. Let's do all the quality of life stuff that we can do. Um, allows for unique interactions. Yeah, let's do this. Let's research the stuff. Um, okay. <sighs> According to mission reports, the crew members set up half of the beacons before becoming... This is the tube stuff, right? Transfixed. Mumbling incoherently and raising their arms upward. The tube being volatilized. Among the vapor and fumes, a few activated sensor beacons picked up traces similar to those left by Vohler propulsion systems. Um, rest in peace, Konstantin Lerzov. We're gonna leave the planet. And we're gonna. Has completed its scale. Yeah, let's collect some sciences. Um, wait. An accident has occurred in the Tycoon. Yeah, Tesla has to go back to Tycoon. Where's Heisenberg? Why are you not collecting the signs? Heisenberg needs to collect signs. Oh no, Heisenberg has to go back to Tycoon. Um, yeah. Yeah. So we have a new technology there. Science. Let's do some research with the time. Science generated. Ooh, I need that. I should have known that existed. So we get more science from exploration. Oh, wow. This is an interesting chapter, I have to say. Also, because I'm not being bombarded by stuff, so I can focus on the story. Early game stuff. I was being bombarded by stuff. But anyhow, I think I've, um, to be honest, I think I've played enough of the game uh, for this session. I hope you found that interesting as I do. Let's just recap. Number one, there was a giant tube. There was a giant people. There's a giant tube in the planet. We checked that out. You know, strange stuff happened to our crew, but they're back except for one guy. And... The more interesting stuff, a bunch of people were checking out a house because one guy was attracted to the house, went into the house and we declared them dead. And suddenly we got a phone call <laughs> back to life, back to reality. Suddenly these guys pronounced that, made a phone call and the guy who accepted the phone call must have been creeped out of his mind and they're safe and sound. We don't know what's going on with them. It might, you know, it might relate to a, another story later. But I found these uh, exploration missions quite interesting because I'm not being bombarded by stuff. So I can focus on the story. I really like all these, you know, two things I like in this game. Number one is the layout stuff, right? Layout, you know, I like managing the design of the stations. Number two, ex space exploration. I just find that interesting, right? This game is something else. Like, I wish they would make um, Ixion 2 as soon as possible, if I'm not. Or like some other developer would make a game much like this and see that there's a market for it, despite the bad reviews. Anyway, that's it for this session. We're going to continue exploring. Hopefully we find some interesting things. Thanks for watching. Peace.